Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Today we're gonna talk about fall trends that you can wear right now. Fall is actually my favorite season for fashion. And as we move into fall, it's nice to have some pieces that you can buy now that will work now and later in the season as well. So I'm gonna go through five fall trends that you can wear now. First, I just wanna say that as I was getting ready to do this video, I left a curling iron on top of my toilet, like on the toilet seat, and it burned the plastic. So that's awesome. Has anyone done that before? My husband doesn't know yet, he's gonna kill me. All right, here we go. Trend number one is a menswear blazer. So this one is from Golden Goose. They have a really great one from H&M that's similar that I will link for you guys. I will link everything in the description box for you. And then I've kind of like done a two in one trend because belting your blazer is a major trend for fall. And it's really cute. Like it's kind of like feminine and masculine at the same time which I really like. I've just put it over a silk slip dress from Maritzia. I really like the navy with the beige of the blazer. And then I'm also wearing it with these mules, which I got from Melon Soulier. I love a white mule. For accessories, I'm wearing All Majuri, which is a Toronto-based jewelry company, and they kind of specialize in bringing luxury to like the everyday woman. Because there's no middleman, they can basically give you more fine luxury jewelry at a much lower price. They are coming out with the Croissant collection, which is kind of like a twist on a classic. It's very Parisian inspired, obviously. So these are the Croissant hoop earrings. Look how cute they are. I really like that they are a little bit bigger. They're so cute. This croissant pinky ring is obviously part of the collection as well as this bangle. I am so obsessed with this pinky ring. These pieces also come in silver as well. So there's five pieces. The earrings, the bangle, the pinky ring, and then they have two other rings that are kind of the same croissant inspired design. Who doesn't want a croissant? <laughs> I do 100% of the time. So that's some of the jewelry that I'm wearing. These pieces are also from Majuri, which I will link as well for you. This little paper clip that I have in my second piercing is also Majuri. I think it's so cute. I am also doing a giveaway with Majuri. So make sure to watch till the end of the video to see how to enter. This look is almost like a little bit 80s, but it's not too 80s, which I really like because I'm not really an 80s person, even though I have been known to wear like those bicycle shorts in a casual setting. So yeah, look number one. So another trend is the kind of satin slip dress. Basically any kind of satin pieces in general. I really like a slip dress or kind of a lingerie inspired top. This one is from Maritzia. It's super flattering. They've cut it on a bias and I find it to be like one of the better slip dresses that I've found. I'm loving the navy color. They come out with new colors every season so there's always options. Yeah, like I said, I love the slip dress, especially with layering in the fall. So you can wear this now, put on a big chunky knit later on. You can wear it with boots. You can wear like a chunky knit and then a coat and then a scarf, works really well. And then in keeping with the kind of satin silk trend, I really love a camisole just tucked into jeans or into kind of a more utility pant, which we will get to later. Also, I am wearing an anklet. It's this gorgeous, dainty anklet, also from Majuri. I like that you can just see like a little flash of gold and I think it looks super sexy with heels. Trend number three is the utility trend. So it's kind of like army green with like pockets or think kind of like army inspired. So these utility cargo pants are from Zara. They were like 40 bucks. They're kind of like an imitation silk. They're super, super comfortable. 
If you don't want to go something like silky or with such big pockets on the side, I do also have a pair of Citizens of Humanity that I've been wearing all summer. They're so comfortable. If you follow me, you will probably recognize them but I will link those for you as well. And then I've paired it with a tank top from Maritzia. Again, I will link everything in the description box. Let me just show you my necklaces. So these two are Majuri as well. I love this kind of almost choker-like chain. I think it's such a pretty chain. I was wearing it today and this woman stopped me and asked me where it was from and I like, gave her the Majuri Instagram information and I was like, they're so good. And then this one is the Zodiac sign pendant. This is Libra, which is what I am. These ones are really, really popular. So yeah, I love necklace layering. So I'll kind of add and subtract every day depending on what I'm feeling. And then lastly, these shoes are old Seegers and Morrison. If they have a version that's similar, I will definitely link it for you guys. There you can kind of see the anklet. It's so pretty. I love it. Trend number four. Whoa, I look so tanned in this lighting. Trend number four is neon. You can do the crazy neon and I probably still will. I have this like tight neon turtleneck and I'll probably wear it with blazers and layer it. But I would say the fall neon is like slightly more subtle. This is brighter in person for sure. This is a T by Alexander Wang cropped sweater, but I will put lots of neon options in the description box for you guys as well. You don't have to be, you know, going high end for this. And I've paired it with these A Goldy jeans. My husband Andrew doesn't like them at all, but I love them. He's like, I didn't know Distressed was in again. I'm like, no, it's just not in on you. <laughs> Oops. But I really like that they're a bit baggier and high-waisted, so they like really keep everything in nice and <laughs> neon is definitely here to stay. It was a huge trend this spring and summer, and I think it's going to stay here into fall as well. The final trend for right now, these are just my top five trends for fall to wear into fall, just because it's so easy to like layer a blazer and a satin dress, but the snakeskin shoe. These are obviously embossed leather, and I would highly recommend getting that. These boots I got last spring. I love them so much. They are from a brand called 80, and I can't tell you how many times people have asked me about them whenever I wear them. You totally don't need to go the kind of bright color route. Like you can do a really nice brown or black embossed leather boot if you just want something a little bit more tame, if you will. I would also do a square toe. This one is just a little bit square, but you can also find quite a square toe. That trend is definitely on for fall. I'm excited to wear these again. So again, if I can find these, I will link them for you. Otherwise, I will link lots of boot options. Okay, that's it. Those are my five fall trends to wear right now. I think you'll get like at least a season and a half out of these pieces. This is so cute. I just love these. So now that you've watched till the end of the video, I am doing a giveaway with Majuri for $250. All you have to do is follow Majuri and myself on Instagram. So once you're following those two accounts, comment on the corresponding post to this video on Instagram. I'll have all the info in the description box below and I'll also have it in the Instagram post so you can't miss it. It's super easy and you can get quite a few pieces for 250 or you can like splurge on a more luxury item for everyday use. As a bonus entry for the giveaway, make sure that you are subscribed to my YouTube channel and comment below when you've done that so that I know that it's an extra entry. Thank you guys for watching and I'll see you next time. Bye! Oh my God, I'm hot. I need an air conditioner.